Hey YouTube, uh, today I missed my time for posting my video so it's posted a little bit late. I guess we're going to do a cooking video today. I'm making uh, spaghetti, it's the easy man spaghetti but it's a good spaghetti. Actually not even, it's not even really spaghetti, it's uh, rigatoni. And out of all of the sauces out there, I am very, uh, well, I like this one, the Bertoli. Any of the Bertolis I like. I don't, I'm not a, my wife likes ragu. Don't really care for Prego too much, but I like the Bertolis. It seems to be the richest one. So what I got here is I got a little bit, I got a little brick of burger. And what I put on the burger, I'll tell you in a minute. And then I have some minced onion. That's, that's about a whole onion in there. And the seasonings that I use, pretty much give you a shot of the ingredients. Pretty much of what I'm using is this stuff here. It's the garlic powder and it's a, a little pinch of Italian seasoning and some black pepper. And then... I don't really care what brand of noodle as long as you like it. And then patoli. So what I did was I took an onion, cut it in half, and I love this chopper. I have had that chopper for years and years. I think ever since I've been married almost I've had that chopper. And that's been a while. I've been married 15 years. And I'm using my skillet that I love cooking in that my mom got me for my birthday a few years ago. If you really want to know the name, I think it's Lodge. I think you can buy them at Walmart. You can buy them anywhere. All the Lodge stuff. It's all good. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to... That's cooking right now. Uh, i got to put some water on the boil. And when I boil my water, it's like it boils. Um, I try to put salt in there to get it boiling faster and a little bloop of some olive oil and the olive oil that I'm using that I put poured a little bit of olive oil in the pan next to the onions so they kind of grill up uh, I guess it's extra virgin olive oil I don't know if this is one of the ones that's like completely real or natural I know there's something going on out there where it claims to be real and it's not I guess organic if there's such a thing as organic, you could probably look it up online. But filling up my pot full of water, and I just dumped it out because it was too full. So I'm not gonna add a little more. Um, I cook a lot of the meals at home. It's not because my wife won't or can't. I just I really enjoy cooking. Uh, I have always enjoyed cooking. Even as a kid, I had to make my own stuff. Sorry if the video is a little bit bouncy. But I really have always enjoyed cooking in my house. I love grilling outside. I have a smoker that I use. I, I do pork butts and the spring all the way to the fall if I can fold them. I do ribs. I actually use Johnny Triggs recipe. If you ever watch Barbecue Pit Masters, I have got yeah, Johnny Triggs recipe. That's about my favorite. I, but I, you know, do it kind of hillbilly-ish. It's not really... It is, but it isn't. Uh, I want to show you this tool that I use. So when I make tacos and I make spaghetti, I think this is a pampered chef. My wife ordered it and I've had it pretty much since we've been married. This thing. I love this. This will mince your meat, mince your hamburger meat and ground it down really, really good. And I just push on it, twist it. You can see it's kind of um, it's still, I should have set this meat out last night and I didn't. 
Oops. So it's still, still defrosting in the pan. But that's all right, it'll work. And then I'll use this, just kind of go around. Now, if you're a person that doesn't like, on like onions, you can you can put peppers, you can put whatever you want in here. Uh, I know people put peppers, green peppers, red peppers, put jalapenos in this stuff. Uh, I like onions. Uh, I like my green peppers and red peppers in my breakfast. But, but that's just the way I like to do it. So... And that's really it for right now. I'm just showing you kind of how I make it. You know, I put the sauce, I pour the sauce in with the meat after I'm done cooking it. And, uh, really good that way. I know it's a different kind of video. Uh, I had already cooked the ramen the other day and had it all ready and set to show you. This one is kind of a... Uh, Kind of, oh, let's just do this today. Let's do, do a little cooking video. It's not hard to do this. If you're a if you're a dad at home or a single dad, I'm not a single dad. I have, I'm still married. You've seen my other videos. If you're a dad at home and needs to do a meal, that's not too difficult to do. If you're not used to cooking for yourself, do spaghetti. Spaghetti is not hard to do. It's really not. It requires two pans and maybe about five minutes of prep work if you're having an issue with an onion. Uh, if you don't have a chopper, you can still cut up an onion pretty good with a, with a knife. I just use a chopper, it just makes it all easier for me. It's not difficult. Um, also, if you don't have an iron skillet, you don't have to, you don't need an iron skillet to cook spaghetti. You can use any any pan that you have. You can use a non-stick or a uh, stainless steel. Um, I'm not a chef. I don't claim to be a chef. I love to cook, but I'm not a chef. I'm a cook. Um, but if you can get yourself one of these iron skillets, boy, they seem to be great of it. All this grease really does season it up. Uh, well, all the meat pretty much flattened down now. And I see I got these onions and I'm going to start mixing the onions in with it to really flavor up this meat. And this will be very good. Oh, here's Dad. You guys want to say hi to Dad in the YouTube world? Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Who are we talking to? Uh, the audience, my channel. Oh, your channel? Yeah. Oh, okay, hello audience. Yeah, he's over, he's come to visit, so he's going to partake of this delicious cuisine that I'm doing, this, this Italian slash Romanian cuisine that I'm fixing here. So, he comes over every weekend, at least one of the days, and he spends it with me and the kids, and has his coffee and goes walks outside in the yard and does little tasks that he likes to do and he brings brings some groceries every week. So very thankful. Very, very thankful. So yeah. Today's a spaghetti day. And this is gonna be a delicious, delicious spaghetti. Well, rigatoni. But I will post maybe in another video, another short clip, what the spaghetti looks like when I'm done. And I appreciate all you guys. Appreciate you tuning into my channel. If you like what you see, um, if you like what you see, make sure you leave me a like. If there's anything else you want to see, please uh, subscribe and or leave me a comment. If you like videos like this, I'll do more cooking videos. If you like videos 
of just me ranting and talking, I'll do more of those. Y'all have a very blessed day. Y'all take care.